Hey guys, uh, today I'm going to be showing you an awesome card trick and tutorial. Okay guys, you're probably wondering why I'm doing a tutorial for this, but I'm doing a tutorial just because... Just because I want to. I don't know really why. I just kind of want to. So, um, uh, I've been getting a few likes, and I have nine subscribers so far, so that's, I guess that's okay for me. Um, I will be doing, like, a 10 subscriber special and a 50 video special. Um, I will be coming out with that pretty soon because I have 51 videos. So, yeah, um, so, uh, yeah, let's get on with the trick. So, we have our deck, okay, and this is a Dragonback deck. As you can see, a Dragonback um, I got this for my birthday, and I'll be coming out with that birthday tutorial, I mean the birthday video soon. So we have this, and we're going to have the spectator choose a card. So let's say they choose just this one right there. This is a free choice, I promise you guys. Three diamonds. And what we're going to do with the three diamonds, is we'll take a three, and we can just um, give it a couple of cuts here. And, okay, a couple of cuts. And, um, <clears throat> so, now, I think the cards are pretty well mixed. So, as you can see, your card, three of diamonds, is not near the bottom. I'm sorry, I have the jokers in right now. It's not near the bottom. And, uh, I don't really think it's near the top either. Let's see, though. So, we have, like, ten diamonds. Let's see. Uh, it doesn't look like it's near the top either. Uh, so, um, but all we have to do... To find your card, just give the cards one simple cut, set it down, give it a snap, and just like that, if I spread out the cards, look, check it out, I know all the cards are face down, right? But there is one card facing up, and that is, here, I'll show you these cards, there's no other facing up cards in this pile, and that card is... The three of diamonds. Learn how to do it. Okay, to do this trick, it's pretty simple. All you're gonna need is a tiny bit of a setup. All you're gonna need is two key cards. We'll use the three diamonds just because, and then the eight of hearts. What we're gonna do, you, this doesn't matter at all what these key cards are. You're just gonna need to place these they're not really key cards, they're just, they just we need them for the trick because it'll flip them over later. So you take them, place them on top of the deck. Now you're going to flip the deck over and then start off like this. That's why I didn't um, have the deck like face down to, when you choose a card because then it would be like this. So if you have them face down on the bottom and then you have them choose a card. Say they choose the jack of hearts. Okay. You're going to, um, what you're going to do is you're going to get a pinky break right underneath that card and then what you're going to do is you can transition that to a thumb break and then all you're going to do is you're going to do a uh, swing cut well I mean you're going to do double undercut I'll make a tutorial for that but just right now you're going to do a thumb break you're going to split the cards you're going to bring you're going to split the cards in the bottom bring these cards to the top now underneath here you're going to catch a brink pinky break right there Okay, and then you're just going to bring this last bottom pile on top. Now what that does is that brings your card, the Jack of Hearts, it'll bring it on top of your two flipped up face cards. So then from there, all you can do is you can show these cards right here. You can say, I don't think it's near the bottom. And then you'll flip it over, which is it's really clean because they don't see any face up cards. But just make sure not to flash these two. So you flip it over and then you show, and and then you're gonna riffle down like eight cards or ten or twenty, or like like this much, okay. But make sure not to flash these cards again. Flip it over and then you're gonna do is you're gonna show these cards, but and then just kind of push them over. Don't really spread them out because then sometimes you might flash this this card that face up. So then all you're gonna do from here is you're gonna have that face up card. You're gonna flip that over. And then, what you're going to do, and then you're going to flip these the cards 
that you had on top, flip them over. And that will leave this card to be facing up. Now, all you need to do is give a simple little cut here. You can give it a snap. Spread out to show the big reveal. That one card is facing up, and that is the Jack of Hearts. So that's their selected card, and uh, yeah. So guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please leave a like and also subscribe. So, see you guys next